This morning, police embarked on a crackdown in downtown Kampala, in which they started arresting deliberate traffic offenders. <laughs> Most of the culprits this morning were driving vehicles on the wrong side of the road and many of them were fined and penalized. The Directorate of Traffic and Road Safety has started a joint operation comprising of traffic police, FFU, that is Field Force Unit, and military police to check on the impunity on the roads in the country. Following the crackdown, Police of today confirmed that they will continue carrying out such operations to fight impunity on the roads. <laughs> While addressing journalists today at the police headquarters, members of the public were cautioned against installing sirens and flashlights in unauthorized vehicles. The appeal follows the growing public concern over personalized vehicles which often violate traffic guidelines. We have government vehicles that by law don't have a right of way. And we have private vehicles. By law, they don't have a right of way. But they've installed sirens in their vehicles and those flashlights. All these vehicles effective today, the operation starts today. They are going to be impounded inspected by the inspectorate of vehicles and after fines will be imposed on them. Farida Nampema, the spokesperson of the traffic police says they will also use CCTV footage to curb the criminals. The CCTV command center will support the enforcement of this operation and on that note the following vehicle owners should report to CPS immediately. On reference TSD 10 18 09 of this year 2022, charged of reckless driving. Drivers have also been warned against putting police and army jackets on their seats. <coughs> there are drivers that put military and police jackets zipped on their driver seats and co driver seats. These vehicles are going to be impounded and handed over to military police to handle that issue. So if you have a habit of putting a military jacket or police jacket on the seat in your car, remove it with immediate effect before your vehicle is impounded and the case handed over to military police. The Traffic and Road Safety Act stipulates that only a few vehicles have a right of way. These include Convoy of the President, Vice President, Speaker of Parliament, Deputy Speaker, Chief Justice, Deputy Chief Justice, and the Prime Minister. Other exempted vehicles include ambulances, bullion vans, fire trucks, police and army vehicles. Tony Patila Humza, CTV, PM Edition. <laughs>